Welcome back to Fit Buddy for Life TV. I'm Tom. I'm Christina. Today we've got a couple's workout for you, focusing on core exercises. We're going to start off with a two-person bridge, the bridge of a troubled water to soothe away any tension in any relationship. Are you ready? I'm ready. So you're going to start facing each other. This is just like a regular glute bridge. Often you're going to have your soles of your feet facing each other. Again, as always, communication is key here. We're going to count down, three, two, one, then we're going to push through our heels to make a giant bridge. We're going to do five reps, and then we've got something special after that. You ready? Make, make sure your feet are hip distance apart for both of you. Three, two, one, up. Hold for a moment, and down. And up. And down. Down, up, down. As you can see, we're articulating through our spine, rolling up, and then rolling back down. Now, we have the fun surprise, one leg. We're going to, instead of rolling and articulating through our back this time, we're going to just press straight up through our hips. Three, two, one, up. Down, up, down. <laughs> as long as you keep moving, it's all good. <laughs> okay. Legs. I think we traveled apart there a little bit, which made it a little tricky at the end. So if that happens, Move a little bit closer. And we're gonna place the other leg. Okay. Ready? Uh -huh. Three, two, one, up. Next we've got a face-to-face, -face, two person plank. This is a good fun one. You can be creative with it, you can, if you feel secure, you can add a push-up, you can play around with the arms. Just make sure you're, you're communicating and you stay stable. Okay? We're going to do 30 seconds here. You can make that longer, you can make it shorter. I'm going to place my feet on the outside of Tom's, so like, now make sure your shoulders are in line with each other's. And we're balancing. Now draw your belly button into your spine. If you want to make this a little bit more difficult, you can walk back and get yourself on a harder angle. Don't forget, because you're facing each other, pull some silly faces. <laughs> and we're going to switch. do those funny faces every now and then. Now really push through that other person's arms and even though you're underneath keep that core tight. Three, two, one. Alright. I'm such a gentleman. He helps me out. <laughs> Alright last exercise. This is a fun one. We fell over a couple of times practicing this one. The position of the feet is really important for this. You might have to play around and communicate with each other to figure out what works best, best for both of you. Where the person on the bottom can get the most power or where the person on top is going to be comfortable. Hands on feet positions. Yes, and the person that's going to be in the air, communicate. Let that other person know where it is comfortable on your body as far as where those feet are because it can be a little bit um, of pressure so um, there is a place where it's not going to be really painful at all. 
and so just keep going till you find that specific spot for you. Alright, so as you can see, for Tom, his legs are kind of halfway up my leg, heels near the knee. I'm going to hold on to his arms to get down. Okay, I'm going to hold my body really strong. Now I'm activating my glutes, I'm activating my core, I'm trying to be as still as a plank of wood. And Tom's trying to move me around to try and challenge me a little more, so I'm trying to be super still. You can hold this as long as you feel comfortable with. And a little lower down. Oh. We hope you enjoyed that workout. We had, a lot of, we had a lot of fun finding that one. Tune in next time to Fit Body for Life TV for more couples workouts.